Hey guys, this is Levi Gann, aka the Viking Buddha, and I'm here today with Jules Derrick, and we are going to do a swan session. She's agreed to be recorded, right, Jules? Mm -hmm. Yes, that's Excellent. perfect. Thank you. And we're going to use this for YouTube and all that good stuff for promotions. Uh, but she's interested in doing a swan session. If you want to see more swan session stuff, I've got tons of videos up already. So just search my channel for swan session and you'll find more of this stuff. Swan was created by Bob Burns uh, over in Scotland. Uh, if you want to find out more there, he's got tons of books and stuff as well. So, all right, Jules, are you ready to do a swan session with me? I am. Excellent. So go ahead and get into the posture of the swan that you know about already. Mm -hmm. I want you just to relax your hand and focus in on that front knuckle. Look at it like you've never looked at it before. And I'm going to ask a part of Jules unconscious, a part that's around, that's wanting to help, whatever her ideal thing is to come in and help her with the situation. Do you have something that you want to specifically work on today? Yes. Excellent. Okay, go ahead and just think about that. And I'm going to ask something to come in, some part of her, something that knows her with the highest intention to help her to begin to show up today. And it can give us a sign when it's here. And that can be a flick of the finger or a twitch of the wrist, some sort of sign. And once again, I'm going to go over, like I always do, one of three things can happen with the swan. One is that we instantly get, you know, a, a movement and that's exactly what we want. And sometimes it just feels like pressure in the hand and you can feel that build up. And that's awesome because it is just feedback, but not quite what we're looking for. And then we'd go on to something else. And there we're starting to get a little bit of movement. How's that feeling? Great. Okay. And then the third thing, which looks like we're not gonna be dealing with today would be no movement and no sensations, and then you would just move on to something else. But it looks like we've got something coming in today, some sort of whatever to help out. Um, so this part that's here to help, can you please make the signs a little bigger so that we can see that you are here to help today? Some sort of a sign, twitch of the finger, flick of the wrist, there we go. These are honest, unconscious movements. How much did you feel you were uh, in control of that finger there? I wasn't. All. Excellent. All right. So thank you very much for showing up to help Jules today. We appreciate that you're here and we're excited to work with you and see what you have to offer. If you were to, if I was to ask you a question and the answer was yes, how would you show me Yes. You can move a finger, twitch the wrist. How would you show me yes? Middle finger, or ring finger. Thank you very much for that. And if I was to ask you a question and the answer was no, how would you show me that? Okay, so it goes up for yes, down for no. Interesting. That's a fun one. Okay, thank you for that. So... I'm going to start by asking, can you help Jules today? Is there something that you can do for her? Yes, excellent. And is there a way that you can help her out instantly right now? Yes. All right. So this problem that she has that she would like to work on today, I would like you to do everything that you need to do to help her clear that up now, if you wouldn't mind. Is that something you can start? Yes, thank you for that. Thank you, thank you. All right, so go ahead and start that process now. And while that's running, are you able to answer other questions?
Yes. Excellent. So go ahead and continue doing what you need to do throughout. We'll call this a session. Uh, and I'm going to continue to ask you questions then. So are you a, would you consider yourself an energy? Yes. Do you have a name? Yes, thank you. Are you a female energy? Yes, thank you. Are you able to make Jules aware of your name on some level? Maybe a feeling, an emotion, or you can just write it out right in front of her eyes. Are you able to make her aware of who you are? Yes. Okay, would you be willing to do that now? Looks like we had a little yes there. There we are, yes. All right, so just be open to whatever comes into your mind, Jules. Any feelings, emotions, attaching, whoever this is to you. Do you have some sort of idea, do you think, of who this might be? Yes. Okay. Is it someone that you can say out loud or you want to keep it private? Alpha. Alpha. All right. Are you alpha? Alpha. Yes. All right, well, thank you for coming here and helping Jules out today, Alpha. We appreciate that you're here and doing all that you need to do. Do you have any questions now that you know who this is that you would like me to ask? You can even ask them privately. You can communicate. Go ahead and just take a minute to communicate if you like quietly. We'll give you the time. And as you guys communicate, I want that thing that Jules came to work on to finish being worked on. Just give me a yes sign when it's complete. There we go. Thank you for that. And have you said all you need to say, Jules? Take your time. Excellent. Is there anything else you would like to know or does this feel complete? It's good. It's good. Okay, so thank you, Alpha, for coming here, Alpha. We appreciate that you were able to do all that you were able to do and clear up anything that needed to be cleared up and help give her guidance. Is there anything else that you would like to do for Jules, Alpha? No. All right. Thank you for joining us. 
and you can return to wherever you need to go. We appreciate that you were here and you can give Jules back her hand and it can begin to lower down. And any learnings that you need to take from that, you can. Any negatives can fade away. And that is a successful swan session right there, nice and quick. <laughs> Amazing, right? <laughs> such, I've got goosebumps. It's such a weird feeling. Amazing. I love the swan. You get so much stuff out of it. And it can happen quick. Ah, like, literally... I was willing her to say yes to your questions, but she did it in her own time. Yeah. Yeah. It's, that's awesome. Yeah. It's so unique with each person too. <laughs> it's weird. And it felt weird. Like I didn't know that it was going to be my ring finger that was going to go up for yes and down for no. I didn't plan that. I didn't know it. It just happened. Yep. And initially, the signal that was showing that it was there was your index finger, which yeah. I thought for sure that would be one of the signs. And nope, yeah. wanted to do up and down for the fingers. I've seen so many different ways of how they want to communicate, uh, yeah. whatever it is. We always say real or imagined, however you want to take it, whether it's just part of the yeah. unconscious mind or something more, depending on your mm -hmm. spiritual level. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, no, it's amazing. I've seen... I was working with a guy and it was his thumb and I was watching for other signals, but it was same as you up for yes, down for no. And I didn't catch it initially that it was doing both. And I was like, can I have a different signal? So I know. And it was like, no, it was a, so let's see. It would do soft down for yes, hard down for no, hard down yeah. for no, and very soft. Yes. And it was wow. kind of confusing at first, but yeah. I was sitting with some other people and they were like, Hey, watch the way it's moving the the pressure of it. I was like, Oh, wow. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. But, wow. Yeah, man, that was, that was pretty cool, man. So can and I know like, who Alfie is or is that a private situation? Yeah. It's probably a bit private. Actually. Okay. No worries. Yeah. 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 Awesome. But I do, I do. I know. Okay. I know. Is Alfie, uh, can I? Alpha, Alpha. Alpha, Alpha, sorry. Alpha. Is Alpha still with us or gone? Um, or is that still private? <laughs> yeah. Okay, no yeah. worries. Yeah, All right, yeah, so yeah. that's this one. So are you still interested in doing a past life as well? Well, yeah, if you want to, yeah. Right, let's Absolutely. Let's just go right yeah. into a past life with this then. Do you feel like that issue has been cleared? I think it's. it feels that it's like, work in progress more positive i don't okay. think i don't think but i think what i get from it now is strength if that makes sense yeah like positivity and all that kind of stuff okay so that's kind of a theme with you so the people that are watching this don't know we've done a past life together before jules and i and the video didn't work out as well so we decided to do another session and that past life was all about collecting strength and it was very centered oh, yeah. about regaining yeah. strength. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and roll into another one. So kind of think of something that you'd like to work on, uh, whatever that is. You can keep it private mm. or you got something? Yeah. Okay, excellent. And go ahead and just close your eyes. You already know how to go straight into hypnosis. And I know this, and you know this, and your unconscious mind knows this. So get into a nice, comfortable space. Take a nice deep breath in. And sink right into your hypnosis as you exhale. Your hypnosis. Your special hypnosis place that's perfect for you. And just allow your unconscious mind to pull you down into that space. There you go. And head right to that mystical, magical garden, the garden we talked about before. Take notice of the ground and how it looks. And what's growing in your garden. How the sky looks. 
how it smells. You can even notice the little sounds that are around you, if there's any. That's right. All the way inside. And you'll notice in your hand, you have a seed. This is a seed of creativity and hypnosis. And as one grows, so does the other. I want you to plant that seed now into the ground, somewhere that's nice and clear. You'll notice clouds beginning to form in the sky. You can even feel some rain as it begins to water the seed to life. It begins to grow up, 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 all the way to the sky. And as it grows, so does your imagination and creativity coming online. So does that hypnosis pulling you down deeper inside, all the way into your hypnosis. Just like Jack and the Beanstalk, that vine grows all the way to the sky. And feel your imagination powering up and coming online. 10 times more, 20 times more. That's right. You can begin to climb this beanstalk all the way up to the top, right to where the clouds are just above your head. And I want you to stop right there for some instructions. You can nod your head when you're there. Excellent. So above you is a life you once lived that has something to do with the problem you came here to resolve today. And your powerful unconscious mind will help guide you through this. Everything that you need to know is right above you. You'll be safe, well, and protected, and my voice will go with you. And when you're ready, you can pop up there and see what's going on. And nod your head when you're there and you can see everything. Excellent. What do you notice in front of you? What do you see? I see the sea. See? And do you know what country you're in? Do you know what year it is? What's going on at the sea? Stormy. Stormy. Are you looking at the sea? Or are you in the sea? Okay, just looking at it. Is there anyone with you? Are you male or female? Female. Okay. Do you know how old you are? Six. You know your name? No. What are you doing at the sea? Do 
Do you know why you're there? No? Lost. You're lost. Is there anyone else around? No. What's the beach look like? Is there a beach? What kind of sand is it? Soft. You know what color it is? Yellow. Do you know where your family is? Do you know how you got to the beach? No? Okay. Is there anything that feels important that you need to do here? Scared. You're scared. Okay. Is there a town nearby? No. All right, well, let's go ahead and move forward in this life to the most important part of this life. When I snap my fingers, you're there now. The most important part of this life. And what do you notice? University. Okay. How old are you? 18. Do you know what university it is? Okay. Is there people around? Excellent. Is there anyone that you feel you would like to talk to? Friends. We have friends there, okay. And you know what you're going there to study? Languages. And can you ask one of your friends what your name is? Maybe have a conversation and see if they say your name. Betty. Betty, perfect. And do you know what year it is yet? Maybe you could ask a friend what year it is. Maybe you could ask a friend what college this is, what university this is. France. France. Thank you for that. Why do you think this is the most important moment to be seen? Is there something you need to do here? Graduate. Is it your graduation day? Excellent. <laughs> so I want you to speed up time a little bit.
and just witness the graduation ceremony. Enjoy it. Go all the way through it. And once you've experienced everything that you need to experience from this graduation ceremony, nod your head. Excellent. Was it a good ceremony? Were your parents there? Excellent. All right. So now I'm going to take you to the end of this life. Your very last day on this world. When I snap my fingers, you'll be there. Now, what do you notice? Peace. Peace. What's going on in your life? Why is this your last day? I'm old. Is that how you die from old age? Okay. Is there anyone with you? Are you in a house? Hmm. Okay. Is it your house? Mm. All right. Let's let this scene fade. I'm going to take you to a new life. This is going to be a future life. One you haven't lived yet, but even though time exists, you have lived it in a certain way. Just one that we don't comprehend as humans. So this future life you can go to now. And tell me what you notice. What do you see? You notice anything? Colors. Where are these colors coming from? All around. Are you on an A? Are you on ground? No. Okay. Where are you? Floating. Are you human? Are you energy? Excellent. How does it feel to be energy? Amazing. What are you doing with these colors floating around you? Positive. Positive. Do you have a purpose? And what's your purpose being there? Energy. Your purpose is to be energy and just exist. Excellent. 
Are you male or female? None. You're just energy. Okay. Do you have a name? Ergo. Okay. How long will this life of energy last? Fast. Where do you go after? Not sure. Okay. I just want you to enjoy this peaceful feeling for a little while. Take any learnings that you need from it and any positive energy that you can shoot towards Jewel's current present life, what I would consider her present life. I want you to send that loving energy to her if that's possible. Excellent. Thank you for that. And I want you to go to the most important part of this life of the energy now. And what's happening now? Stronger. Okay, getting stronger. Why do you need to be stronger? Not sure. Okay. Is there anything that you need to see or do while we're here that feels important? No? Okay. Once again, just enjoy this moment for what it is. Feeling stronger. I'm going to take you to the last day of this life, this future life. Now, what do you notice that's different? Nothing. Do you feel even more strong? Do you know it's your last day here? And how does that make you feel? Infinite. Do you know where you're going next? Still don't, okay. All right, let's let this scene fade all the way down. There you go. Taking any learnings that you need from this, leaving behind any negatives feeling powered up and charged up, knowing you were infinite in your energy and just enjoy that for what it is. Now I want to talk to the oldest part of Jules, the part that's been with her from birth and beyond. Some might call it the soul. Some might call it the higher self. And when you're here, you can simply say hi. Hi. How are you? Thank you for joining us. Why did you show this life to Jules? Mm 
Is she safe right now? Excellent. You can just let her process for a minute. Let her do what she needs to do. Let any of that negative emotions that needs to come out, come out. Any thoughts that are holding her back. Feelings, images, thoughts, sensations. Any pressures and pains, any guilt, shame that needs to come out. Days, weeks, all the way back to when she was a little girl. Just let that process now. Just let that go. Even that. There you go. There you go. Take a nice deep breath in. And on exhalation, let the rest of that go too. There you go. And can this oldest part of Jules help clean up anything that needs to be cleaned up so that she's feeling wonderful in her life? helping any parts that need to come into alignment, to come into alignment with each other. There you go, let it all go. And when you know you've done all you can, you can open your eyes and feel brand new. Take your time. Let everything come into alignment. And when you're ready, when you're ready, you can open your eyes feeling brand new. I want to thank that part, the oldest part of Jules, for helping guide her through this. We appreciate that you were here to help move her forward. giving all negatives in that past life, bringing all positives forward. There you go. There you go. Doing wonderful. Let that go. Let it go. Let it go. There you go. Awesome job. Wow, yeah, again, man. Yeah, again. That's great. So you had uh, some interesting stuff going on there. Mm -hmm. We were a lost six-year-old there for a little bit at the beach. And you were scared. The sand was yellow. We couldn't get a date or anything on it. You said that it was a stormy day. I figured out your name was Betty. You went to the <laughs> university in France. You were there to study some languages and you witnessed your graduation. Then you were very peaceful and died of old age in that life of Betty in your own home. 
And that future life was very interesting with all the colors and positive feelings, very similar to the last one we had, except before it was a physical plane, if I remember right. Uh, this one was more energy based, but still gathering energy again, which is a very common trait of whatever you got going on in your future life there, always <laughs> gathering energy. Uh, you said your name was Argo. And what? Uh, your name was Argo as the energy. And uh, it was a very fast life you had mentioned. It wasn't going to be a long drawn out process, but you didn't know where you were going. You were just preparing and getting stronger. And you said at the end of that life, you felt infinite. So, very cool stuff. <laughs> <laughs> How much of it do you remember feeling wise and emotion wise, I guess? Yeah, I do. The strongest feeling was, I remember being so scared. I remember like the sea. I remember the noise. I remember the waves. I remember not knowing where to go. I remember like really strong, really strong. But I, there was no detail. It was just feelings of being overpowered. Right. Obviously, you were able to square that up because you ended up in a university. So where <laughs> you got taken care of, right? <laughs> That's I think good. that might be a deep desire because I never, I, I always regretted I didn't go to university. Oh, yeah. So that might have been a, like a deep desire yeah but you made it to where you are now without it You're doing good right yeah 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 yeah, yeah. <laughs> on your own studies yeah yeah it's awesome <laughs> wow uh, and then that energy life do you recall much of the energy life it was just a feeling of incredible like like i want to say peace it was just like nothing specific just colors and feelings and like but just good stuff okay good stuff and for those um, that are watching uh so we did the swan today we did a past life regression and then afterwards i rolled it into a emotional detox is what that was uh which is carl smith's thing so that's always fun to roll right into it's, oh it, it it knocks you for six yeah <laughs> like i you know i thought i was done but clearly there's yeah. i think it's it's interesting like if you get in the right zone can i say there's there's probably still little bits that you know you've forgotten to remember okay I don't, yeah i don't know <laughs> you're feeling great now yeah yeah really good really um positive well, positive Excellent. you know really yeah good thank you levi brilliant yeah, absolutely awesome. brilliant and i'm still blown away by this one because that to me i it was such a weird feeling it, it was just weird but great. <laughs> I think we uh, ended up doing this uh, really well, the way it played out. I'm happy with the way it turned out. So mm -hmm. I wasn't planning on doing an emotional detox either. <laughs> I saw it needed to happen and I went for it. And, well, uh, that's what makes you a great hypnotist. Right. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. All right. So we'll end the recording here. Thank you, Jules, for joining Thank us. Thank you, Levi. Uh, guys, you know, the rules are whatever. Do uh, subscribe, like, all that good stuff. And I will see you on the next video. Wow. Thank you guys for watching that video. I'm Levi Gann with Swift Hypnosis, and I appreciate all the support that you guys have given me so far. If you would like to click the subscribe button to be notified when more videos get uploaded, just click it right down there. Click the like button on this video as well. I'll be doing more tools for anxiety, showing more live demos, and continuing forward trying to push quality content out to everyone. So like, subscribe, continue following along, watch these videos here, here, and thank you so much.
take care. Thank you guys for watching that video. I'm Levi Gann with Swift Hypnosis, and I appreciate all the support that you guys have given me so far. If you would like to click the subscribe button to be notified when more videos get uploaded, just click it right down there. Click the like button on this video as well. I'll be doing more tools for anxiety, showing more live demos, and continuing forward trying to push quality content out to everyone. So, like, subscribe, continue following along, watch these videos here, here, and thank you so much. Take care.